Hey guys, Mr. Krabs ASMR here. We've kind we found some police officers over here. They're IDing this man over here. They have no idea I'm here. But that's besides the point, guys. Um, we're monitoring the situation. Uh, another unit just pulled up. Actually, we should probably get out of here before something goes down. You know. But um. Where's my Sprite? I need a nice cold beverage. So the other unit's here now. They got three police officers surrounding this guy. I was just coming here to get some food. But uh, I think I'm gonna bounce. Cause we don't want nothing to do with this situation. I don't even know where to put my water. But, uh, we got three officers surrounding one guy over here. You see him over there? Oh, shit. You can see him over there. Three officers. You can't really see the third one. I fucked it up. There's three officers on him, guys. We're monitoring the situation. I'm getting the fuck out of this parking lot before shit goes down. Because they're doing some type of investigation. And I don't want to be a part of it. You got narcotics in the car. And I'm an arms dealer. So we can't be around this situation. The three policemen are going back to their car. I'm getting out of here. This is... I'm not dealing with the fuzz today, guys. I ain't dealing with the fuzz. got a bounce. That guy's pulling into a parking spot. It looks like the cops are done dealing with him, but we're getting out of here. We don't want to run in with the fuzz, guys. You know, it's just business. I was supposed to make an arms deal out here. Someone was picking up three choppers and two glizzies. If you know the lingo, then you know the lingo. If you don't know the lingo, just know that they're big guns, okay? They were making a big pickup. I'm, I'm guessing it got busted. That could have been my customer. That could have been an undercover. They, that could have been, they could have thought he was me. You know, they could have thought he was my, my uh, customer. He could have been my customer. We never know with these types of things. We just had a close run-in. So whoever the knock is, all right, whoever the snitch is, you got to stop it. All right, I'm on to you. I've got my men looking for a mole. They know you exist. And I know you're watching this video right now, buddy. So you better, you better watch yourself, okay? And if I were you, I'd take a trip out of the country and it'd be an extended vacation. So I'm gonna find out who you are. You're gonna be in trouble. I'll tell you one thing. You don't wanna know what happened to the last guy that crossed me. I fed him to the rats. And then guess what happened to those rats? I burnt the rats and then I fed the ashes to an alligator and I blew up the alligator. All right? And there's no evidence that this happened. And there's no evidence. You, you, you're not gonna find the remains. There are no remains. The best you can do is maybe you'll find a piece of fucking, you'll find a cell off of the alligator. That's all you'll find. Maybe, maybe there's like a contact. Maybe you can find like a couple flakes of alligator dust on me or something, I don't know. You know, maybe there's a drop of alligator blood on on my jacket that I wore over my hazmat suit. And guess what happened to that hazmat suit? It got thrown in the shredder, and then the whole shredder got thrown in a fire, and those ashes got burned in another fire inside of a plastic bag. 
You see, we, we cover our tracks tenfold, guys. And that's not even, we're not even getting into the ocean deal. We have a spot at the bottom of the ocean that we dump our, our waste. It's in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Or was it the Pacific? I don't know, guys. We, you see, we're so deep into this. You can't escape it. You can't fucking escape this, guys. You're not getting out of this. Okay? So I just needed to let this go. I, I need to let you know that... Uh, any first world country that you move into, I got guys there. Alright? If you're the mole, you're going to have to go into some shithole third world piece of shit that I wouldn't even bother putting guys in. Your life is going to be so miserable, but at least you'll be alive. You won't have to go through the months of torture that we'll get away with, by the way. Nobody even has to take the fall when we take care of you. Because you're a mole. We got guys in every police force in about 13 states. The rest of the states, we got guys in most of the police forces. We got guys in the FBI, CIA, NSA. We got them in everything, guy. You're not getting us. We're the most powerful organization there is. You're busted. You're cooked. This is your warning. We're coming for you.